Welcome back. Smart the Ayrshire Vlogs are here. How you are doing? Hope you're all well. So I'm back out with Sean and his 990 Super Dog. So we're just out for a quick blast. We're going to head along to Largs. Cameras are running. Let's see what we can capture. I'm in one of the moods tonight to make a nuisance of myself. Look at that view. Love it every time I come down here. So I'll catch back up after the intro. Welcome back. So we're just going to head along the coast towards Largs. Negotiate this lorry. See what these guys are going to do in their cars. Guys, right, so I switched the cameras on because there's a couple of favours I want to ask. A little bit of help. It's a glorious night, it's about 16 degrees, might get a couple of spots of rain but nothing major. Love it, love it, love it! They speeding in the 30s. That's the way we're in a quiet bit. So, as you do, you're always looking at bikes. So the XSR 900 has caught my attention. Last week, I had a wee shot of the brand new MT-09 SP and I'm set up to get the brand new MT-10 as well for a wee shift of that. But this XSR, I like the look here. Basically it's an MT-09, the bottom half of the bike. The rest is a kind of retro looking Right. But my local Yamaha dealer hasn't got one in the showroom so or a demonstrator so I can't eh, fling my leg out it, so to say. So anybody watching that's got a brand new XSR 900 or has had a wee shot in one I'm looking for you to tell me a wee bit about it. I want a kind of real world view here. Just a normal everyday biker who's had a go on it. If you could let me know how it feels, how it rides, how the power's delivered. Or the usual stuff you look for. Here we go. Let's see if we can get a nice angle at this roundabout. For the 360. A 
as always say, I bet the views going along this coast, you'll never get tired of them. Never. Let's see if the cops are here tonight. Doesn't look like it. Hi, so XSR. If you've ridden one, the new one, 2022, or you've bought one, you actually own one, then send me an email, info at airshorevlogstart.com Some pictures would be good as well, some nice photos, and let me know what you think of the bike. Because I'm really liking the look of this bike. And as you know, I'm a Yamaha fan. So the second favour is I'm building a website, may already be built and running by time. This video gets uploaded. I'm looking for some feedback regarding that as well. So on the site, you'll obviously have the homepage tells you a wee bit about myself. I'll have a frequently asked questions page. I'm obviously going to move into merch as well. Just a way, obviously a couple of videos back the way I was feeling. I was going to take a break for YouTube and maybe even a bit break for biking. So that's no change, so if I'm going to do it, I may as well do it right. So, I'm in the process of building this webpage, it'll be nothing fancy, it's just straightforward. But I'm thinking of doing a kind of weekly blog on it, which I'll update each week with what's happened during the week, or you could cover anything. News about bikes, new bikes. What I've been thinking, what I've been doing, where I've been. I want to go by that. Hi, right, so I'm thinking you're doing a weekly blog. Also, think you're doing a selection of bikes that the previous week, if I'd been out that's went out for a ride with me, a meet up or I've met them, I'm going to lag to know who I'm talking to, got a couple of pictures of their bikes and stuff like that, that's going to be on it my latest video for YouTube will be on it, obviously with some sort of subscribe button and all the rest of it, all the usual stuff you would expect for a moto, a moto vlogger's website so again to the same email address, info at airshirevlogster.com Let me know. Alright son! Oh. <laughs> he was about to say something to me there. Again, any kind of input, any kind of feedback on that would be very much appreciated. You can also, if you've got an idea for something you'd like to see on the website, we still have all the usual social networks, but this is just the next step. As I said, I've decided to keep going with the YouTube channel. There'll be some changes, obviously, because there needs to be. So, that's why website's the next step. And that's currently in progress. So that'd be great if you could help me with the two of them. So that's us coming in to Largs. So we'll catch back up with you.
once we have a coffee 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 well that's me had my coffee with Sean need a hot chocolate actually but anyway So as I touched on earlier, a couple of videos back I was ready to chuck it all in I don't think I would have ever chucked in the, the bike sort of idea but I'd definitely seriously consider getting rid of the, I'm not getting rid of the channel but just what, no uploading so now I'll upload when I want and obviously change some things a new sort of style include a wee bit more in it it's just no me riding about in the bike mix it up a bit is the word I'm looking for so I've got some ideas I'm already working on a couple of videos in this new kind of addition to the channel see how they turn out, see how people or the viewers take to them you'll still have me riding about obviously now even if I'm no planning to vlog it's still worthwhile sticking the cameras on which I will do but if I'm going to keep doing it then it was time to change that's what I'm in the process of doing get the website up and running couple other bits and bobs will come along the way I've just taken delivery of the Rode Wireless Go 2 that will fit to the 360 but I'll also use one of the mics to position at the back of the bike to catch the exhaust note and I'll see what I can come up with in the helmet should improve the audio dramatically so plenty plenty gonna be happening if I'm gonna do it I may as well do it right so another thing as I want to give a big shout out to Z Head Motor Vlogs and Lockwood 92 Motor Vlogs. These two motor vloggers had a chat with me back and forth and they helped helped me make the decision to keep it going. So a massive shout out to them. ideas or anything you'd like to see on the website it'd be very much appreciated so until the next one cheers <laughs>